What's going on gamers? Davis Deadly back with another PS5 tip and trick video. Uh, if you're having an issue with your PlayStation uh, trying to sync to a network for a game like Outriders was doing that a lot, they patched it, but if your PlayStation still does it, or you get a lot of uh, freezes in your games or things like that, it could be trying to connect to the network or it has like a background network check. This tip could help you prevent that too. And another disclaimer, on my videos, I've been getting a lot of like comments down below, tech wizard unbrick my thing, go to his Twitter or Instagram or whatever. Do not do that. That is a scam. Uh, stay away from those. I try to delete those as much as possible and report them as spam. So stay away from those. But without further ado, please subscribe, please like. Let's get into this video, guys. This tip could help you fix some issues you may be having with some of your games. Let's do this. All right, guys. So from the start of this, you want your PS5 completely powered down. So hit the home button. I close all my games out too when I shut it completely down. It's just a thing I have to do. OCD maybe. And then so hit the home button. Go all the way over. Not rest mode. Power completely off. Then down here at the top is the eject and the bottom is the power button. <clears throat> you're gonna hold it down and it's going to beep and then you're gonna hold it down until it beeps again to power back up. Once it does, let it go. And then it's gonna ask you to connect your controller via the charge cable. Just put it on top of the controller into the PS5 and then power the controller up. And then it will be in safe mode. From safe mode, we're going to scroll down to step five, number five, clear cache and rebuild database. We're going to clear system software cache first. Just hit OK. It's going to restart your PS5. Once it comes back up, power your controller back up. It's gonna log you in. And now that we did that, it's going to check and see if anything, so if stuff's not auto updating, it'll auto update your games that you've been playing. And then we're going to power all the way back down again because there's another step to do. To completely shut it all the way down. And we're gonna follow the first couple steps of hitting the power button, holding it until it beeps twice, and it's gonna come back into safe mode. We're going down to clear cache and rebuild database and we are gonna rebuild database this time. It says it's gonna take a few hours. It does not take a few hours. And it's gonna restart. It says four minutes. I speed it up here. It's it's about four minutes for me. It may be different for you. And there you go. And it's gonna power right back up to the home screen. And you're gonna notice your games are all swapped around and it looks more like it did right out of the box, but all your games are gonna be there. It's gonna sign you in. So if you have any, I had issues too, where I had like old titles I deleted towards the front, which was just like a hollowed out uh, box. And then I cut through that. I had a ton of games, so it took a while. But if you notice, some of my games are now locked. And I'm gonna show you how to fix that if you have this issue. So head up there, go up to settings, scroll down to user and account, and then you're gonna go down to other and then console sharing and offline play, and we're gonna restore licenses. Hit restore. It's gonna take a few seconds. If you have an error too, don't worry about it. Just proceed on to the next step. And then we're gonna go up to uh, 
console sharing and offline play, you're going to enable that. So anybody that's on your console, you'll be, they'll be able to play any content you buy digitally. And there you go. Now everything is unlocked and ready to go. Uh, this should clean up any issues you have where like some network uh, temporary files are getting in the way, uh, causing some crashes and like just random hiccups like that. All right, guys, that's if you are having any kind of technical issues with your games freezing or not loading up properly. Uh, the, this might help you, might not help you. Uh, it might be a deeper issue than this. But uh, I love to hear from you. If you have any more questions or anything else you want to uh, ask me, please comment down below. You can go follow me over on Twitter at Deadly underscore Davis too, and ask me questions over there as well. Also, I just posted a video about uh, Ultimate PS5 gaming setup. Let me see your PS5 gaming setup. You can tweet me your Ultimate PS5 gaming setups on my Twitter as well. But until next time, guys, my name is Davis Deadly. Peace.